Hello everybody, this is Terry Jeanette with the Tapping Flamingo. Today we're going to do a little bit of diamond painting from some things that I got from my friends over at New Craft Day. We are going to make these really pretty seahorse little charm thingies. They're little pendants with some crystals and glass beads hang down. First one I want to do though is this one right here. I've done some diamond painting before and I do have some videos. Um, I'll leave a link to the playlist actually at the end of this video so you can click on there and check that out, the unboxing of these and some other projects I've done. But I found this quite interesting because we have all different sizes of crystals in this particular kit. So let me get everything organized and we'll start putting on these pretty little glittery things. So I went ahead and cut open these. They really struck my eye. Aren't those pretty? They're little pink roses. The letter on there was the I. So we see an I here. So these are going to go there on the front and the back. So the first thing I'm going to do is I, I got my pen and I have my wax. Peel this back, and I need to put some wax in my pen. I got it on there, and what this is going to do is it's going to allow me to pick up and put on there. These, I, they're big enough where I can probably just pick them up on my own, and probably too heavy for this. But um, I'm going to try to do this whole side here of the seahorse. I gotta get the little film off of here to expose the glue. There we go. Whoops. I'm gonna go ahead and take the whole thing off because I plan to do this all in one sitting. But I know that this goes here move them around a little bit. These are going to be so pretty. Okay, those are really easy to do. I'm going to put these away and then the next ones I'm going to get are the eights. They're a little bit smaller, but they're not as small as the really tiny, tiny ones. Let's see. And find a that's a triangle division sign equal sign a star they got all kinds of different symbols here's here's number eight okay so I'm gonna pour these in there like that and you shake them and they kind of flip over don't need them all to flip over there. But the ones that are flipped right side up are the ones I'm going to be using. I just do that. Look at that. Get them kind of not right there. You can move them a little bit off to the side. And I believe that's all the eights. I'm going to finish this side and I'll come back and show you what it looks like. So I'm going to do the division signs next and they're really tiny. I just want to see, show you how these flipped over very easily. Let me just shake them on, <clears throat> shake them up. All right, I got lots of division signs to do. And I've got the first side done. Isn't that pretty? I love this area right here. I think I'll time myself on side two to see how long it took. It didn't really seem like it took that long. So I have the other side done. And it took about 15 minutes. And I was uninterrupted. <laughs> but about 15 minutes to put all this and also put everything back in to the individual containers here. So 
So I poured them out, put them on here, put them back in here. And this whole side took me about 15 minutes. Now I need to do the other one and get all the crystals and stuff put on these. I got the blue one done, and he pretty. Like I said, they're double-sided. I'm going to have to take some pictures now, go outside. What a nice sunny day today. So stay tuned for those at the end. I don't recommend that you hang these outside, but they would really be pretty in a window. If you're interested in getting your own diamond painting pretties, I've got all the information down in the description box below with a coupon code. Thanks for joining me today. Y'all have a great day. This is Terry Jeanette with the Tapping Flamingo signing out for now. Bye-bye.